What's up, you guys? My name's Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. I got a channel to end, so I decided to um, share it. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. I appreciate all, every like, subscribe, share, unlike, um, donation. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Row 5. Okay, so the channel I received was very heavy drama coming this Thanksgiving. Um, I heard, um, and then, and then right after, it was about a minute after that, I heard, um, someone's about to reveal at the Thanksgiving table that they were gay. That was the first one. Now, everybody has different viewpoints on that. I believe you're gay, you're gay, but some people don't believe in that. They, uh, are very judgmental. So I guess whoever is about to reveal they're gay at the dinner table, one, they don't care. They obviously don't care, um, that people think they're gay, know they're gay, or what have you, they're not going to care. They're just going to say it. But the people they're about to say it to, I'm assuming is about to be very, very pissed. <laughs> I'm assuming. Um, but kudos to the person, uh, if this is for you, kudos to you um, for doing it. Kudos. Because we need more people in, in uh, the world like that. Absolutely. Absolutely. So kudos to you. Shame on your family. That's how I feel if that's for you. A family is going to get the police called on them soon for theft of the past and abuse. At least one person will be arrested in this. Oh, God. Okay, I heard a family is about to get called on them for theft and abuse. At least one person will be arrested in this. So, um, now... You know, it could actually be on Thanksgiving Day. It could be day before Thanksgiving. It could be on Black Friday. You know, Thanksgiving, people celebrate Thanksgiving at different times. So everybody's on a different time of life paths. So whenever this resonates for you, I guess I should say, um, how, whenever you do your Thanksgiving, um, just saying, just saying. I mean, I wish I had my kids this Thanksgiving. I'm supposed to, according to the court paperwork, but I didn't notify five days prior. So I actually get mine on Friday. So I'll be alone by myself on Thanksgiving. But most of you guys will probably be with people. You will be with people around the Thanksgiving table. I'm presuming because at least one of you guys or somebody you're connected to is about to display you're publicly gay at the Thanksgiving table. I personally think that's the best. I think it's the best because that's the way to do it. <laughs> so kudos to whoever that's for. <laughs> Just saying, I think it's the bomb. But um, somebody else is about to, their, their family is about to get the police called on them. So I don't know if it's on Thanksgiving Day, day before Thanksgiving, today, tomorrow, however that resonates, day after Thanksgiving, because there's some kind of abuse and exploitation of the past. I heard at least one person in that will be arrested. Um, so you pl plug it in how it resonates. The family will be very publicly mortified, but they should have known it was coming. Okay, I heard the family will be very publicly mortified, but they should know what's coming. So the family is going to be very publicly mortified that there's at least one person is going to get arrested. Um, but I heard they should have known it was coming. So you plug it in how that resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. Someone's child is going to have such a mental breakdown at Thanksgiving that they're going to need emergency mental health treatment because it's such drama. Oh my God. So you, this is terrible. So you plug in, if it's not you, it's somebody you're connected to possibly. Um, I don't know who the crap these people are, but it's somebody out there, some kind of Thanksgiving drama. So you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody's um child i heard is going to need severe mental health it sounds like emergency treatment um because they're going to have a mental breakdown a uh, nervous mental breakdown at thanksgiving because it's such drama um so somebody is putting their child around some severe um anguish and drama and craziness um so much so as some kind of thanksgiving gathering some people have four thanksgiving gatherings to go to some people have one some have none some have ten but it's some kind of Thanksgiving gathering. It's going to cause such nervousness and anxiety and 
panic mode is going to cause emergency mental health treatment. Um, so you plug it in, how that resonates, that's terrible. You should never expose your child to any kind of, um, any kind of negativity, a any kind, period. Um, you should never succumb them to any kind of abuse, uh, period, period. And in Aries, masculines, young child is going to get severely ill around Thanksgiving. Severely. Okay, and I heard of Aries, masculines, young child is about to get severely ill, Ill around Thanksgiving. Severely ill. So Aries, masculine energy. I just did a reading, channel reading on Aries, masculine. It might be the same one. It might be a different one. Um, the one I did earlier was older Aries masculine. I did not hear older in here. I just heard Aries masculine. So um, Aries masculine energy. They could have Aries in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, north of mid Jupiter charts. But I heard they're about to get severely ill around the Thanksgiving holiday. So, um, and I didn't hear what they're going to get ill with. Um, just some kind of severely ill energy. You plug it in, how it resonates. And a family member is going to walk in on another family member having sex. Ancestral relationship. They probably will snap a picture. Oh my God. Wow. And a family member is going to walk in on another family member. Ancestral relationship. They probably will snap a picture. That's what I heard. So probably will snap a picture of the ancestral relationship. That's pretty sick. If you ask me. It really, really is. Maybe you're the one snapping the picture of the people, uh, ancestral people having sex. You plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. An Aries masculine is about to have a severe lawsuit brought upon him very soon. By someone he would have never expected. And he will not be successful. Good Lord, a lot of Aries masculine energy in here. Okay, so Aries masculine is about to get a lawsuit brought upon him soon. I heard um, by someone he would have never expected. Um, it's not going to be successful. So um, it sounds like it's a personal lawsuit and not a like company lawsuit, like professional. It sounds like it's personal, but you know, it could plug in different for different people. I heard by someone he would have never expected. So I guess it could be coworker energy too, possibly. Um, it could be coworker energy, possibly. It could be. And sexual harassment is about to become a huge topic at a Thanksgiving table soon. It's going to make many people very uncomfortable. And an ancestral relationship. Oh, my God. Okay, and I heard um, sexual harassment and an ancestral relationship. So, for some of you guys, if this plugs in with you or somebody you're connected to it could just be one or it could be two or more but sexual harassment apparently is going to be a big topic at a thanksgiving table soon and apparently i guess maybe the ancestral relationship that somebody's going to walk in on and probably snap a photo um probably but you plug it in how it resonates oh my god that's why, I mean, I'm going to miss my kids so much on Thanksgiving. Absolutely. 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 But I'll glad be by my damn self because I'm putting up with that bullshit. Hell to the no. Nay, nay, nay. I used to hate going over to like people I dated's house and my ex-husband's house and having to hear all the drama. So this is, I mean, that's some bullshit. Just saying. But you plug it in how it resonates. I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.